Yo, what's going on everybody? This is your boy Leo Zante back with you with another video. I know it's been a while, but today I'm just going to do an update on my account um, and then show you where I've been going. I've I been, I been doing a lot of grinding since before, um, last time I showed you my account, so I just want to show you, uh, especially since I haven't really been doing any YouTube videos in a while. So let's get to it. So first things first, as you can see, I got the Odoa, Kill Fae, Warrior Light. Been working on a lot of units since then. You are in MR. I'm just going to slowly, slowly show you what I've been working on. Um, Let's see. I've been working on my Ice Tank. Nasha. I think she's going to be useful in the, in the future, so I've been working on her. Uh, slowly building her up, especially with her job levels and stuff. I'm running out of a lot of materials for that. Uh, yeah, slowly, just uh, I've been using a lot of Zia. I've been doing a lot of uh, Renaissance uh, leveling, do a little Esper leveling with my uh, people, with my units, and yeah, just been just been grinding nonstop, leveling up, trying out different characters. Limit breaking them, awakening them, as you can see. And yeah, I did pull Delita and Agrius. And I've been working on Frederica. Last time I didn't, I didn't never, I never used Frederica. She was like one of the last units I have uh, gotten. So I've been working on her, Stern, Shadow Links. Pretty much a lot of my URs right now. I got pretty much all the URs right now so far. The only character I'm missing is an MR. It's that lightning, that new lightning uh, paladin. I'm missing her, but eventually I'll get her. She's a she's an MR, you know. Eventually I'll get her. So uh, yeah, I've been working on a lot of uh, using a lot of Fravia or Fravia. I've been using a lot of her. Been uh, leveling them, leveling them up. Uh, so far though, one of my new units I love the most is. Odor, uh, I think she's freaking beast. Uh, I really do like her and uh, her concept has her design. Uh, the only thing I'm missing that I want to get with her is I don't have a golden sword. Uh, the two-handed golden sword. So I'll show you my equipment later. I've been working a lot of that too. So I've just been leveling and using, uh, as you see, I'm running out of gold. I mean, I got 70 million, but I'm running out of gold I, because... Uh, even when even when they have this weekend, we could do the gold farming thing. I've been using a lot of gold power leveling all of my characters. I've been using every single one of my characters, especially my Cherie. I've been using her since I know a lot of people don't like to use her, but I, I like to whack people inside the head with a mace. So I think that's fun. Um, I've been using a lot of my uh, Lorenzo. Yeah, I've been using a lot of him and some of the content, uh, especially because he's the Dragoon. Like that one stage uh, Final Fantasy Tactics 2 event, I could just jump right over the uh, jump right over the uh, the wall, and I just go straight to attacking the um, enemies with Lorenzo, because he got so, such high jumps. So I use him with Victoria, and they they work they work well together. Um, I'll show you my Argus where I'm at right now. Um, eventually in a couple more days, I'll probably limb break her. So I'm not really too concerned. I mean, to me, I feel like limited um, limited units are pretty easy to limit break because their shards are so freaking, especially with the uh, Winsby shop nowadays. Like, when the beginning of the game, I was struggling just to limit break think I mean, I mean, this now, this, I got all three of them. And uh, it's, it's pretty, it's going pretty smooth, especially with the... Uh, the expeditions and you get a lot of tokens and stuff like that. It's it's going pretty smooth. Pretty happy with that. Um actually I got pretty lucky pulling you got a Delita especially. You got two pulls with Delita, about eight pulls with Agrius. And um, Mastadio, I got him with Delita, so <laughs> I'm not even gonna worry about Mastadio. Uh yeah, um, with this event, uh especially with the, the metals and everything, I could get like a lot of uh Frederica shards and stuff like that. I'm gonna show you some of the other characters. Um, 
Yeah, I got my Gilgamesh uh, Lemon Break four. Never buy, never buy none of his shards. It's either with dupes and uh, running out some of the hard quests every now and then with him. And I got into Lemon Break four now, so I'm happy with that. It's because I was never going to buy his shards. I think that's a rip off, <laughs> but yeah, he's pretty good. Uh, some of the units I'm working on right now, I'm working on uh, Eileen. I am working on. Yes, Mr. Leonis. I am working on Ingelberg, Gilgamesh. Uh, I am also working on Whisper. You see, they got, you know, everybody almost limit break three right now. So in a couple more months, I'm pretty much going to have all the URs maxed. Uh, I don't want to try for it. I just go for the hard quest. You know, uh, it's pretty, it's pretty simple. I mean... It does it does it does help that I got some pulls, uh some dupes. So it's all luck of the draw, really. I got a lot of dupes with uh Stern and I never use them. So I'm definitely gonna be working on him. Um and yeah, that's basically it for my uh for my units right now. Um yeah, I've just been working on every every single body of what I have really. Um I usually so this is how I train some of my units. I usually put five units or well, four units together and then I put my last unit, I put a new unit. That way I can easily farm up their uh their experience and farm up their renaissance with an Esper. Because you know, you put too many new units, the the, the quest gonna start going slow. You know, your units ain't that powerful, can't clear the quest that fast, so that's what I do. I just pair them up. I every time I get to a unit to a certain level, you know, like uh every time I get like four let's say if I get like four strong units, I use some of the four my four of my main team, and then I just pick one uh weak unit and I try to squeeze them in there. <laughs> and that's how I got some of these characters uh the way they are, uh, especially with uh Renaissance and all that stuff. Um like like Tyrell, I didn't last video I didn't have that much uh wasn't level on Tyrell, but now I'm Tyrell's up there now. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Okay, so let's talk about my equipment now. Show you some of my equipment. Don't want to make the video too long. So first thing first, I'm going to show you some of the weapons. Got the Chrism Savior, Platinum Sword, plus five. Osafoon, this weapon right here was hard to max out for the critical form for me. Uh, so uh, I am very proud of this weapon. I spent like every single one of my steals trying to max this weapon out. And then I failed it. And then I had to keep resetting. Uh, before I had like 30 of these uh, reset, resmiths. And then I only had three at one point. And then uh, I finally got it to the max. Um, so I'm very happy with that, especially for my... Uh, or uh, Rob. Uh, I got. I was working on uh, resmithing certain um, equipment, like my Razagethi. Been working on that. Been resmithing stuff. Um, I had to resmith this one. Um, I did have a powerful one last time, but I I try not to use some of my seals and see the luck of the draw <laughs> and see what happens. So I try to you know resmith them. Um, but now. I'm pretty much gonna probably probably gonna have to do some of the uh, the seals on this weapon, my lion heart. I got the sleep blade. I'll eventually resmith that one too because I don't. I know you don't go for the attack all the way, but I kind of want my attack all the way because I use this on uh, multiple characters like Rom's uh, Friar. Yeah, mostly my spell blades and uh, red mages. I use this on so. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna probably resmith it because I want the attack just a little bit higher, and hopefully I get the rest of the stats maxed out. Uh, let's see. All right, let's talk about because I think it's going. Let's talk about my armor. Then I'll show you my trust master last. I got the platinum robe plus five. This was uh, really easy for me to max out. I'm happy with that. Mm, they're showing my trust masters. I'm trying not to really show my all my trust masters. Okay, uh, the armor. I got two armor lights, one barrier, one shield. 
So I've been grinding for that a lot. Got one smart coat. I wish I had two, but it's fine. One smart coat is good enough. Sage plus uh sage hat plus five. Um, I got the golden armor. I'm probably gonna resmith this one one day. Not right now. Just because I want to lower down the evade. Haven't gotten lucky with the evade stat. Uh, I got the golden helmet. I have no really no plans for this. Uh, yeah, I kind of have no really no plans for it. I probably get to plus five one day. I don't know. I gotta have a lot of materials, like excessive materials, and then maybe I'll get it to plus five. And then um, hopefully the evade will go all the way down to zero. Just in case if I want to uh, build a missile resistance team. Uh, mithril plus two. I might just keep it like this, to be honest. I don't think I'm gonna plus five it. Uh, maybe because I, I feel like there's gonna be another uh, heavy armor with a base stat that might have a dodge on it one day. I don't know. Um, Mirage vest. I got it to a plus three, but I'm I could get it to plus five with all these equipments I have, but I decided not to because I was running out of armor books, and I'll eventually I'll get that to plus five one day. Not right now. It's not needed right now. Uh, I'll go to Zandra, right? Ring, uh, yeah, I got it to plus five. A lot of my equipment got it to plus five, um, and, uh, yeah, I, I can farm the, uh, I got the, I got like 91 of these, uh, jewel rings, but I'm probably not gonna use it. So, uh, I think, I don't know, I just don't really care for that equipment right now. Um, so for my weapons, which I'm really happy for, which I've been working really hard with, uh, I bite, I missed like the event of the cat claws. I didn't really grind. I had like six cat claws. Uh, so I bought a lot of tons of cat claws for um, my Exia and, um, what's that lightning monk? I can't remember her name, but, um, yeah, I bought a lot of, uh, a lot of, uh, the cat claws and I'm almost done. Plus, uh, plus five in it so I got the plus three right here and um eventually I'll, I'll get to get it to plus five and then I'll use an exia uh let's see and then for any future monks and stuff but we might have more future monk weapons one day I hope Gumi bring out some more uh blunt users for real like some monks clerics I want some more green mages yeah, man, I I like them. I like I like playing with them. So, uh, let's uh, so some of my trust masters I've been working on. I got the still maiden me uh, necklace fully maxed. I got stage uh, mage hairpin, fully maxed. I'm pretty much you have to use this with the right build to for it to be effective. Adolan's uh, apron. Um, I'm getting it max probably by next week, hopefully. I'm slowly working on it. And then um, my next equipment I'll probably max out is probably going to be the glinting armor for my King's Blade. I really like that armor. So, uh, let's see. Yeah, so this is pretty much all my Trustmasters. Um got a lot of it, even Phoenix Weapon, which I really do like. Magicite, Shadow Ninja Blade, Lightning Katana, Dragon Slayer Lance, Flame Blade, Vermilion Sword, Moon. Man, I got tons of, tons and tons. It really opens up the gameplay once you uh get the all these Trust Masters. Uh, let's see. So for this event, I've been doing a lot of these. Uh, I had a lot of Expedition tickets. And I've just been hitting these expedition tickets and getting lucky with uh, my white mansion sites and stuff like that. I'll show you. So I had like a, I had 144 of the two hour tickets never used. 10 hour, uh, 10 of the the 10 hour tickets. I got a ton of them. So sometimes um, I might just leave without buying the shards for Delita and Agrius. Might delete them at like. Maybe just like 90 and it's just hopefully I get the enough tickets and just I'm like, I think I'm gonna get enough to be honest. I mean, we got we got a lot of days for this event, so I'm not really too concerned about it. I know they all both all three are gonna get maxed out regardless. Um, 
Oh, let's check out my espers because I've been working a lot on these two. So one of my favorite espers so far is the Twin Headed Dragon. I got it to level 78. It's about to be level 80 eventually. <laughs> uh, got the Diablos. Uh, I've been working on a lot of my uh, Death Machine Diablos, Siren, uh, Shiva, Tetris Silphid, and uh, Golem. I've been working on a lot of my uh, Espears uh, so far. I'm pretty much after uh, Twin Headed Dragon, I probably work, start working on Odin more. You know, I think I had a lot of opportunities to work on Odin or to max him out, but I think uh, I think I just I just wanted to max out Twin Headed Dragon because I don't know why, but I find his uh, kit very interesting. So yeah, I think I want to max him out because I like Odor a lot, and I got the Twin Headed Dragon uh, with Odor, like the Renaissance. So yeah. I think that would be fun. So let's check out my medals. I'll show you some of my medals because uh, I've got pretty a lot of them. I'll tell you my future plans with my medals, what I'm going to do with them. I got 1,393 medals. So I could probably buy around, let's see how much. Almost 28. Almost 28. So that's around 270 shards or 280 shards. So I'm not going I'm not planning to use my medals at all until until the after the after the water mage comes. Once the water mage comes and I pull and I try to get the water mage, I try to see if I get any dupes and then from there I probably max out uh King Leonis first. And then I think uh, with Heart uh, Heart Quest, he should be around like maybe 80, 90 ish. So hopefully I get to max him out too. But I, and I'm not counting on that. So hopefully I pull some more dupes of both of them. I pull a lot of dupes with this event with the Aileen. <laughs> Aileen had barely no stars last time. And now she's uh, almost limit. I think she's limit big three now. So she, that's good. Um, Frederica. Uh, I might just leave her alone because I feel like she's about to get a little bit break five very soon, very quickly. Same thing with Stern. So I might just leave them alone. Um, I might just focus on uh, some of my spear units, Odeli and Aline. So I might just use the shards on them instead. Uh, so my MR shards got about 997 of them. Uh, I never, I don't have no, really no plans to use them. Only time I use my MR shards. As you can see, is I buy the tickets, and then if I need one, one or two um of these items, and I don't feel like grinding them out, I might just use it for that. Same thing with my uh SR shards. Yeah, I got tons of them. Uh, so I might just leave that alone. So if I don't feel like grinding them out, I just pull some of it and I just. Damn, just harping job level up some of my uh, characters. Uh, I wish I get some more of these medals, these rare medals. Because there's a one point in time I was uh, running low on faint memories. Okay, it's 969. So you can just imagine I pulled like 40 of these. Uh, about, no, th about 30 of these uh, this week. Just to help me level up, uh, I mean, job level the, the Lita and Agrius. And my UR uh, Vision Metal Shops. I really have no plan to use these right now. Um, if I get some dupes for uh, Ifrit, and I might be I'm missing like 10 shards or something like that, then I'll use it for that. But as right now, I am just going to stack these up and save it for another day. And so I really want to level up my Vision cards. One, because the... Um, to level them up is very pricey. Um, not even with the gold, but just with the eggs, uh, the vision eggs things. So those are very. You need a lot of those to level them up, which I do have a lot. But I pick and choose which one I want to level, depending on my need for them. And I got about seven thousand uh, MRs. Um, some of them I don't have maxed out i got mostly all the mrs uh cards uh, limit break and maxed out 
But I think I'm missing a, a couple of the new ones. I don't know which one is it. I don't know. If it's, oh yeah, so it's like deceptive vows. I can I can max that out anytime. So I just might just use it on that eventually. These I usually just use it on the growth eggs if I need them. As you can see, I don't. So not right now. I just stack them up. Who knows? Maybe come with an update. Maybe come more useful. Uh, and yeah, that's pretty much my uh, account so far. So I don't think I'm missing anything else to watch the show. And I think that's pretty. Oh, my vision cards. Oh, I forgot my last one. My vision cards. So this, this is some of my vision cards right now. Uh, yeah, I've been working a lot of my vision cards, max them out. Got that Shiva number 99 now. Uh, I could have maxed the Dream Field Fiend Diablos, but I decided not to because uh, I feel like I'm gonna get some dupes of him in the future. So, so to save my Vizio for this event, I decided not to grind him all the way out so I can have the max pulls for Delita and, and Agrius. And, uh, Good thing I did because it took a lot of my Vizior. Uh, I am right now, I am grinding for the Blade of Grass. I want this card because of the accuracy. And the attack but, um, up is uh, it's a bonus, but mainly for the accuracy because I feel like I'm, ha I'm, a need I'm, I'm in need of this card in the future. In the future, so uh, yeah, I'm definitely going to gonna keep grinding this out. This is, the, this is my real grind. Of this event is <laughs> getting it. I didn't get pulled no dupes or anything like that. So I just been every time I got the Winsby, I've been pulling in those three shards, three shards, three shards. Every single time every single time. So um Yeah, I'm, I'm eventually I'm gonna get my Ifrit maxed out. Just hopefully I get a dupe sometime. Same thing with the goat on twin headed golden dragon. Or maybe I'll just wait for another event. I think that will come around because of the raids. The twin headed dragon will come back and be a feature of vision card or something. Uh, Test yourself a card I'll eventually max out. I might max out just because I want to use it on my Adora. I don't have a reason to max it out. I just don't know when. Yeah, I just don't know when. I might just keep it on the standstill because I don't have too many. Uh, I already know I'm going to use uh, my priority right now. Is that, uh, Blade of Grass vision card, and I don't have too many rain, uh, rainbow spheres, so uh, I'm gonna I'm save it for that. And then um, eventually, once I get the 99 uh, Blade of Grass uh, vision card level out, then I'll go for the test still fit. And once I have enough uh, vision spheres too, because and that around that time I should be maxing out the other uh, some of my other UR units. So that's gonna take a lot of those uh, spear saw as well. Uh, uh, eventually, I'm gonna. Go on, I have. I have a. I have some um, builds for this. The fleeting blossom banquet. So eventually, I'm gonna max this card out too, because I really do want to use it. Um, yeah, that's that's something I'm gonna be working on, and I'm also with the blade of grass. I'm also pulling this red chobuco card not for so the reason why i'm pulling this card i am mainly pulling this card for pretty much one unit that i want to use it on and that's probably mastery so that's why i can't wait till the platinum and the healing rods come out oh my gosh the platinum mace and the healing rod <sighs> yeah i'm gonna be grinding the heck out of that just for mastery and uh for any future green mages and stuff like that um so i'm 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 I've been pulling the three shards every single time. I, as you can see, I got 51. I did pull some dupes of this when I was pulling for Delita and Agrius. So that helped out a lot. So yeah, this this by the time this event ends, I I will be having the red Chobuco max out, which I'll be happy. Uh, Golem, surprisingly. I never worked on Golem. And this is all from dupes. Pretty much, uh, my golem is almost maxed out. Yeah, this is all from dupes. So, a couple more dupes and I'll get golem maxed out. 
which um which will be interesting. Um, same thing with uh, I want to get this maxed out because I want to I want to use some critical builds, and I think it will be fun to get this maxed out. I know a lot of people don't like this card, but I think it will be useful in the future too. So we're gonna get we're gonna get that maxed out eventually too. Oh yeah. Uh, some notable uh vision cards, the Iron Giant. Uh, I could get this maxed out anytime. I feel like it. But for now, uh, I might just leave it alone for now. I wonder how much it is it for uh, just to use it for the silver. Okay, thousand eight hundred forty nine. Yeah, I might just leave it for now. Um, yeah, I've been doing a lot of grind. As you can see, the all those eggs and doing a lot of grind. Well, um, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I guess you could call my account the whale account, but um, lately I haven't been spending too much. So um, the only time I spend money now is on the event for Delita and Agrius. Yeah, the I buy those uh, the double packs. I bought those, um, and then I buy the five dollar. Uh, sometimes I buy the five dollar, uh, you know, daily tokens when you get like double. I think those are the best way to do things. If you get those, the the five dollar one, and anytime they give you like double vis visior, I think those are the best uh, way to build your account. If you're going to spend some money. Um, other than that. I also played a lot of these. Uh, I don't know if it can show you or not. Hopefully it doesn't mess up. I'm going to click it. I've been playing a lot of these. Uh, as you can see my. Uh, I played a lot of these uh, games. Not because I want to. But because I need the Vizior. <laughs> so. I try to limit how much I, I spend, so I play a lot of these games, especially, I, I played three of them, I played the CSR Racing, um, which are the ones I did, Guns of Glory, and the Star Trek one, right before this event came out, so I get that extra, I think, around, it's almost approximately like 4,000, 4,000, 5,000, 4,000, approximately like 5,000 Vizior, right there, right before this event came out, so just so I could, um, Pull a little couple extra times. Oh man, and it helped out a lot. Now I I pulled them out. Like I got enough Vizior to max them both and save up for the water mage, which is pretty nice. So uh, this month I I mean I very I've been limiting how much I spend. I know that my account looked like I spent a lot. Um in the beginning of the game I did. Uh, like I told you in the last video, I, I spent a lot on, uh, this event for this vision card, which is, I know a lot of people say don't chase vision cards. And yeah, I thought this was a limited time, like in the, um, like, uh, in Japanese version, I think Japanese version, this was a limited time vision card. And then, um, I, I wanted it because I was tired of getting it, uh, my ass kicked by some, uh, evasion units. So I wanted the accuracy, accuracy out of the luck card. And when I got it, yeah, I was kicking their ass. So it was, it was a pretty fun time at around that time. But at around that time, that's how I got all my MRs and all these other extra medals and random stuff and dupes and all this other crap. And um, yeah, that was like the most time I spent money in this game. And I would never do that again <laughs> for any card. Uh so for future events, this is what I'm, I am going to be working on. For the future events, also for my vision cards, I want to get my uh, Science of Shadow vision card maxed out um, for my Thinkrid and to protect myself against some dark units. Yeah, I'm talking about that Super Stern. Yeah, I want to uh, protect myself against him, so I'm definitely going to be working on that. And I know a lot of people are going to be using him a lot. And uh, what's where is the other unit? It's an MR card. Oh, <laughs> right in front of my face. Uh, and then my Shadow Bringers card. Um, this I got this to around this amount before uh, the event closed last time. Uh, I didn't. This is on the beginning of the game. I didn't know how things work and how 
limited these cars are. Or, I mean, it's not for everybody to chase, but for me, it's just almost this close to maxing them out. Might as well. I mean, give me something to do. And I already got Think Rate maxed out, so give me something to pull it on during that event. So I'm definitely going to be working on those cards. Um, and yeah, I hope you enjoy the video. And I'm going to, you know, cut the video off now. Y'all have a nice day. Thank you.